footage is a bit, um, a bit slow is because it's getting dark. I'm going out on a stealth tonight. We've had some bad storms as well. They were, uh, we had them last night. So, as I said, it's getting dark. I decided to go up on the Mendips again, because it's, it's quite close to me. Besides the fact, I've hardly got any, I've only got a quarter of a tank of diesel, so I've got no money to put in my fuel in. I'm going to show you what it's like when I get there. It's up past, um, up, go up past the place where we go camping. And carry on up over. It's Charterhouse, they call it. Um, there's a raceway up there. It's literally right up on the top. You can't get it's the highest point. You can't get it anywhere. So uh, I might get some photos of that again in the morning. So um, if there, if I manage to get anything, I'll uh, I'll tag them on in the in the vid. I've decided to see if I can survive from what's in me van. Bit of a uh, bit of prepping sort of type thingy. <laughs> you know, it's basically, if I have to go a very short minute's notice, for whatever reason, like, um, I don't know, floods or something, if I've got to take the family up on the top, I want to see how long it can last. Well, no. Well, whatever. What I'm trying to do is to just survive with what I've got in the van. You know, because I've gone up there before in the past, I haven't had no provisions, I'm like, ugh, I've got nothing. Anyway, I always carry, I always carry provisions now, so, uh, um, I do need a bit of prepping. <laughs> you know, so, um, if you, uh, if you get snowed in, or, or snowed out, or whatever, you know what I mean? Or if you break down somewhere, you can't get home, or whatever, you, you, you know what I mean? You, you want to be able to survive with what's in your van. Anyway, let's waffle. I'll, um, if it's bright enough, I'll um, show you what it's like when you get up there. So. Van, you could might be able to see it a bit better now. Look at that. There's that. There he is. Here's look. There's my mates there. And um, yeah. Hey, anyway, I'm going in to make me tea. So um, we'll have a chat in a minute. It's, um, it's quite dark now. I um, eight o'clock. I've had me tea. It's cold. It is. Oh, five. Five degrees outside. It's only eight in here. I've um, I've just been in having a cup of tea with me mate, so I thought I'll um, pop back and do a little vid for you. Um, yeah, I'm, I've not planned to do anything this weekend. I just um, I just fancied doing a stealth. I've uh, I looked at the um, I've looked at the weather forecast. And um, there's supposed to be some really bad weather coming in tomorrow morning. So, uh, whether I shall get out with the camera and get some pictures. I, well, I took, um, I took a, a night shot. I, took, I tried to take a picture of the van here in the dark. So, um, 
it'd be interesting to see if that comes out or not. Yeah, some um, my beans on toast for me tea. So nothing major there. Um, yeah, it's got some nice views out here. Nice starry night tonight. Got a really nice view of the sky. It's just a shame I can't film it because um, it won't come out. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I'm. Uh, I'm sorry to say I'm struggling with content at the moment. <laughs> it's um, I think it's because of the time of year. Because it's because uh, it's winter, and it's all cold and dark and miserable. It's you like this. Do you know what I mean? It doesn't. It doesn't inspire you very much, to be honest. It doesn't. But come the new year, hopefully we'll be out doing some more stuff. Want to uh, maybe go out and go a bit sort of further afield this time, which would be nice. I'd like to do that this year. Anyway, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna get my phone because I'm filming this on my phone. So I'm gonna. Uh, Plug my phone in and watch a film. And um, I'll have a chat with you guys in the morning. So, I'll see you then. Good morning, people. My God, it was wild last night. I don't know if you can hear that. But that's windy. That's windy. That's really windy outside. The whole van's going like this. Um, it's just past 8 o'clock now. 8.7 outside, so it's not that cold. It's slightly chilly now. I've just got out my bag. Um, I should make me a cup of tea. Buy me breakfast. My vent's really annoying. The, uh, the bearing's going in it. Well, I put a new bearing in, but I think it's the plastic casing. Oh, it goes very really fast. It just goes digga 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 digga. You know? It wants pinching up a little bit. You know, I don't know if you can hear the wind or not, but it's... It's pretty wild out there. The other... The other thing is the, um... Let's turn that one off, isn't it? Is that better? The um the vent in the floor has got like rubber flaps on it. And when it's windy, it goes flap 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 like that and you get a draft. It comes up through the floor. That's really annoying. <laughs> I didn't realise that. But you need the ventilation, you can't shut yourself up completely, so But these work really well. These um I've shown you this in an earlier video, I know. My um, the roof light. If, uh, oh, if you are doing um, if you're doing a stealth camper or something like that, I I think I think these roof lights are invaluable. I mean, it's blowing a gal, right? And there's no draft from that at all. It's very very well designed. Um, the rain doesn't come in. The only thing I've found, when I'm doing a stealth, um, by the time I've blacked my windows out, there is no light showing at all. <coughs> I walk around the van, I put a little thing over the vent at the front as well, um, so there's no light, so I can park anywhere, I can park absolutely anywhere, I can park in the middle of a car park, or I can park outside somebody's house and they'd have no idea I was in here. But the roof light glows and you've got the lights on so it, it, it's you know what I mean the only way I can get round it is I've got a piece of that oh excuse me I was a light that was um tiring night last night that wind kept me awake yeah I um I put some of that silver stuff that I put in my windows up in the up in the hole in the roof light of course, the trouble is that blocks me ventilation then, look, so I can't have a fire on and nothing like that. Um, right, I'm going to have my brekkie. Um, hopefully the, the rain doesn't come to anything, and um, I'll take you outside. Right, I'm going out for a walk. Well, we are going out for a walk. Oh, there you are. 
We're parked up out the way. Not causing no harm to nobody. Just thought we'd have a have a mooch down the path and have a look. This, yeah, this is um that's the quarry there, which uh, I don't think they use anymore. And that's Mendit Raceway over there. There's a lot of um a lot of puddles in <laughs> I think it was pretty wet last night. It was blinking windy, wasn't it? Yeah, getting blown to pieces last night. I didn't, um, I didn't sleep very well last night. The old vent, the roof was going. Duh, 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 all blinking night. Yeah, because I thought it was going to get any stronger. I was going to move. <laughs> I was rocking too much. Yeah, because your van's are in mine, isn't it? I had my roof box on. I could hear it sort of vibrating a little bit in the wind. Well, you can tell we're looking at the heavy. They're all very um, windswept and. Spartan is it? Is that what they call it? A bit thin. It's all very... It's pretty bleak and open up here, really. Oh, tickets, please. <laughs> yeah, they were. I don't know if you guys can see that over there. Can you see that? Yeah. So am I pointing in the right direction? I can't see. <laughs> Yeah, that's Glastonbury over there. That's where we was the other uh, week or two or whenever the hell it was. A couple, I think it was about two or three weeks back now. <coughs> I swap sides, you can have a look. So there's this raceway in there. I don't think they've been used for a while, have they? Yeah. Well, we've been up there. We've heard about we we've been up here. Yes, that's true. A few months back now. Yeah, yeah that used to, didn't they? Yeah, they used to have four in cabins and that in there, didn't they? God, look at blooming rubbish up here. It's terrible, isn't it? What a mess. Yeah, this was open yesterday. They were working in round the. Oh right. In round the back. Oh, don't you? Yeah. Ready for next year. yeah, well this is like you said, this is where all the competitors come. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is the... Yeah, all... See that over there? But that's a lot of rain. <laughs> And it's coming over here. Come on, that's cool, yeah. And Glastonbury Tours, right? It's slap bang in the middle of it. <laughs> God, that's rain, isn't it? If you guys can see that, can you see all that over there? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Sorry, it's a bit fuzzy, I'm afraid, because it's not a hot, proper zoom on this camera. Um, phone. Right, well that's rain and that's coming our way so I'm getting back in me van. Right then, I'm going home. <laughs> I left my window open last night. 